Happy Bird Earth! This is Monkey Man, and thank you for joining me in another stream of Survival Saturday here on the Monkey Island server. Today in this stream, instead of doing whatever we want, as we usually do, um, we're gonna make this, like, pretty much Monday's episode, because we got one of our new tribe members online, um, and he's gonna help us tame up a Quetzal for our tribe. So that's kinda gonna be... Uh, our episode. So if I seem like I don't respond to chat or anything like that, it's probably because I'm using whatever I'm saying as part of the content for the video. Connected. Boom. Channel switched. What's up, gangsters? Oh, just me. Brandon's not on at the moment. Oh, what's up, poophead? Fine. Nobody lost your face. Shut up. <laughs> I, I like my you. face. No. My mom likes my face. Are you sure? Are you sure she's not just saying that? A lot of people's moms do say that. No, I have no idea. Exactly. Get out of there, war horse. You're not wanted in there. So, do you have, uh, trank arrow darts learned? Yes. Just make me the bullets and bring me the gunpowder and the narcotic and I'll make them. Okay. Bullets. Stop hitting my raptors. Okay, I'm coming over to you. Are we gonna use Argent, or...? Uh, we're gonna use an Argent. What's your stamina speed up on your Argent? <clears throat> I have 1,200 stamina and just regular movement speed. 1,278, 75 stamina and 140, 137 movement speed. We'll probably end up using the one I'm on. Uh, yeah. For sure. But I'll tell you how long it'll take to turn another one, Quetzal. Okay. With raw meat? Yeah. We'll throw a prime in there, though. When we get it. Hello, Raptor. Quetzal, 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 Quetzal. Can you pick it up if it's a female for me? Uh, I can't pick it up. It's knocked out inside your taming pen. Ah. Uh, but it's a female. Have you, any, have you got any meat you can put in it for me? Um. Uh, I got two prime yeah. meats. I don't even want to say how long it takes with raw meat. A while. I can't open its inventory, what the heck? There we go. One prime meat, two prime meat. Okay, it ate those up and there's nothing else in its inventory. I'm coming with some meat. Go away, turtle, you're not wanted. Well, the two prime meats got it to like 25%. If you go upstairs and you go into the feeding trough, there's some raw meat in the feeding trough. Just chuck that in up now. Yeah, you can take these. Where are they? Whoa. Those are for the darts. I'll get busy then. Have you got gunpowder? Uh... I didn't think you needed more gunpowder. I'll check. Oh, you don't. 15 knock darts coming up. Sweet. I hope that's enough. Yeah, I think they... I thought that they had changed the uh, recipe for it. Before, it used to be ridiculous to make. I can see your butt. You're level 70 and running around in your underwear and a cloth shirt. I don't want shirts. I want to show you my pecs. You got little nipples. But leave my nipple alone. Get a little nipple. Oh, what's going on right here? Uh, I don't know. Something was shooting something. It made me stress a little bit. Huh. Okay, I think you have enough prime meat now. Do what? Your little two pack right there. One, two. Yeah. If I was any taller, it could be a six pack. <laughs> It kind of looks like... It sort of is a six-pack. If you look more higher towards my pecs, you can see the third ab. Eh. Looks more like, uh, cinnamon rolls. You got a little cinnamon rolls. <laughs> <Ow! laughs> <laughs> that was worse. You got little muffins. You got muffins. Where's my argent? Oh, the argent there. Oh, I've got to figure out where to put the beaver. Uh, hello, Mr. Beaver. Maybe if I put it in the bed, like on top of the bed. He's got some yellow teeth. Like... You didn't take him to the dentist or anything? He needs to get his nah. teeth. He's whitened. His teeth are pointy though. I like his teeth. A little, little bit. They're like used. This tooth looks chipped. We got like a raggedy, raggedy beaver you got. He can burp his ABCs. Oh. He's got a little patch on his cheek. It's so cute. You got a little white patch on your cheek. Brandon sat there and he's like, what should we name this beaver? And he's like, hold on. I know it's not a beaver. But this is my favorite character from Over the Hedge. Let's name it Hammy. Hammy. I'm like, oh, yes. It sort of does suit it because it's the color of Hammy except for the white stripe. I love that movie. I'm just going to store my stuff that I don't need. Uh, 
Do I need a sickle? Just throw me the, uh... The what? Darts. And the smithy. And the smithy. What had, um, the... Yeah, that one. What do you have in me? Pew, pew, pew! Right in the face! Shoot you right in the face! I'm, I'm wanting to get all my, um... Who pooped? Weight as low as I can at the moment. All I have on me is nine food. I don't think I weigh that much. I only weigh... I weigh under 100 with all my stuff on me. Ow. We're back on the Quetzal hunt. We're back on the Quetzal hunt. Oh, it's a Bronto attack. What's going on over there? Who are they fighting? Oh, a Rex. A level two male Rex. <laughs> Bye. Oh, there's a gold drop. drop so I can get, the, get it, get it. But you like me, you get distracted too easily by the drops. Uh, yeah. If, if you watch my YouTube videos, I get distracted all the time. So do I. I can't get anything done. I'm like, what was I doing this episode again? It's like when I was hunting, doing my, um, alpha hunting video, I had to stop and do that clip with the, um... Where the beaver dam? Bigger. Oh, crap. I didn't realize that was water. If you can, can you check the beaver dams and get either cementing paste and rare flowers and yes. pearls? Yes. Watch out for the beavers. Help me. Take it like a man. Yay! Now, I could imagine just dropping you in the swamp and letting all the Titan Bowlers wreck you. Ah, my ghillie suit, they can't see me. They have to be really close to see me. Does that actually make it so they can't see you from a certain distance? Yeah. Wow. Oh, look at all those things that could kill me down there. Alligators, snakes, dimorphodons. It's dimorphodon city there. down there. What? Yay! Hello, Quetzal! Level Email, right? I've yeah. got to get above it so I don't hit, so the bullets don't hit me out. Pew, 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 pew! Okay. You hit it? Uh, you need to get closer. I hope to God it does not fall in the swamp. Pew! Right in the face! I oh, farted out of his wings. Settle down now. Settle down. Hurry up. I'm gonna shoot you in the wing. Oh, I got you again. Wanna try and draw it away from the swamp if we can? One more shot. Did I miss? Yeah. I missed. Get closer. I at least want to get it onto that, that hill in front of us. Alright, the neck! Neck shot! Let's go that way. Don't go into the swamp. Don't turn. No! <gasps> Why do you like the swamp so much? It never leaves this spot. Mm. If it does go in the swamp, we'll have to go clean it out really quick. Aim for its head. Are you cool with me moving? Yeah. <clears throat> yes, go that way. Fall down that way. Around. That was uh, five so far. Go. Oh, right in the wing. No. How much stamina do you have? A little bit. We're going to have to land soon. Sharpshooter, sharpshooter monkey at your service. Pew pew. Pilot Brandon. This is the part where on my video I'm gonna be like, three hours later. <laughs> go. Oh, get, go oh. down, go down! No! No! Drop me. It's dead. It's completely submerged. Why, Quetzal? Why? Oh no! Make a promise! Wow. Oh, I thought you got died by Mega Prana. Yeah, it's oxygen. It's Gonzo. Can you help me take out this, um... Thingo? So what are we gonna do now? For the rest of the video? Or... Find um, another Quetzal. <laughs> I reckon it might be quicker if you take... If you go back to your base and take out, um... Gout. Thing oh, is, we can't tame this quite so I'm gonna kill it. It's already dead. Did oh. they drop anything? No, okay. Okay, what was that? I was too busy getting killed. I'm just getting the meat from this quetzal. Okay, now we need another quetzal. Okay, yeah. Right. Right. Are you close to the green obulus? Where are you close to? You just keep going down the river where we were headed. It's at that island in the middle of the swamp. 
Did we wait until day? Probably. <laughs> we'll just tail it until day. There's a... We can make a little camp right here and make some food. Yeah, I've got some raw meat. We just need to make a camp and... Stuff. What did you how do? Many, uh, how many dogs are we looking up? I don't know. It's actually like all 30 dogs until we like get it up to look out. How many dogs did it take to take out the level 1? Like 10, I think. Not very many, but I did all headshots. Probably take double. Ready, leave, monkey? Yep. You leave. Uh, let's see. I found it. Where? Yeah, it did work. It's like where we started. So, That's the thing. more closer to my base. Yeah, it's like right where we were staying for the night. Get to go. Near that island. that it's not right click. That raptor is. Are you good at the blue obelisk? Wait, oh, there's time left. Are you ready for this, Brandon? Do I have to shoot a wild flag? Wild I don't flag? think you're ready for this, Jelly. Yeah, just shoot it in the head while it's fine. Oh, got shot in the head. Wait until it stops. Don't just spray it because you'll waste because you'll probably miss. Because it'll slow down. I hit it. Okay, Quetzal team number two. Or attempt number two. That hit the R jacket. Bro, well, like your eyes stupid wig. Oh, stop, stop. It's down. Is it in the swamp? No. Yeah. Well, it's in the swamp, but it's not in the water. Okay. Tell me then. There it is, here. Yeah. Can we go, can we go, can we go, can we go? Come on, Loki. Loki, you give it. Yeah, I'm fighting a bunch of crap. Yeah, it's a good point. Pick him up and grab him. That's how to go. I got that thing too. Watch out, because the Sarko's there too. I killed the sucker. Okay, where's Stop the me. quits on the... Take me to the quits real quick. You got bugs following you. Me? No. Yeah. I'm stuck in this stupid parasite. Can someone go kill these bugs with me? Oh, I can't. I'm, I'm back where they just myself. came. Ain't killing stuff on the way. Gonna take you a while yes. to get here. Uh, there's a car another day for the uh, quits. Are you kidding me? Nope, it's dead. We'll get the other... Yes. Caught it. Starts. Yeah, you're just getting more supplies, but so we can actually. We weren't even prepared to get this sergeant. Not this sergeant, this Quetzal. Yeah. Should have started by saving two, should have been there. We've lost two Quetzals. Not that bad, dude. You need to clear my way so we can get a beaver thing so I can level up faster. I will. After we get this quest. It's going to be a doubly long stream. Just for you guys. Just because we suck at getting quetzals. It's our first quetzal. This is not going to be a fast when I'm done with it. And then I will need to get stone. This other quetzal is a level 9 female. I honestly don't think we should go for it, dude. Because it's a level 9. Five hours and only four minutes. And it's Money an hour and fifty-eight minutes with Prime. Welcome back, you guys. Welcome back. After a horribly failed stream of taming the Quetzals, um, I think our tribe gave up on Quetzals for now. Um, I would start taming one, but all my tribe members are offline at the moment. So, it doesn't look like we're going to be able to get one tamed up for this week's episode. So, we have to go to plan B. We have to find a plan B, which is to tame up something else or do something else. And I have chosen to tame up some of those new dinos that were implemented in the last, I want to say the last update or the update before last. They're like, they're called the Listros. And what they do is you put them around your base and you pet them. Like little puppy dogs, you pet them. And they help level up your dinos quicker. They give better experience to the dinos that are in range of its uh, uh, petting. Ness, pettingness, that's gonna be our new word. When we pet it, it's pettingness. Spread love to all the surrounding dinos. So, I don't think they're too hard to tame up, but I'm not sure what the radius is for their 
pet-ness. So, we're just gonna go out and get as many as we can before the end of the episode. Which isn't gonna be... Which, I don't know how long the episode's gonna be. I guess it depends on what editing's like. So, I think they like rare flowers shoved up their butts. So we're gonna get some of those, put them in slot zero, and see what's what. I'll bring you guys back when we find Alistro. Peace. And we're back, and we're like five feet from base. Our base is right over that little lumpy hill. And we found this guy. Let's see. What level are you? Level one! It's the greatest thing in the world. Uh, level one. Right next to this bear, though. Female dire bear level eight. Well, we'll go over there, murder the bear, and then see how many flowers it's gonna take for this guy's butt to like us enough to come home with us. Are you gonna, are we gonna be able to kill you? Level eight bear is gonna probably murder our face. Please don't kill us. I love you. I love you. Kick you in the face, you like that? Claw you in the eyeballs. Got him. That was close, he brought us to like half health. Okay, we'll land here. Are you on neutral? Let's just make sure. Okay, and we'll go sneaky, sneaky, stealthy behind this guy. How many flowers are you gonna take? I don't know. Hi, oh, don't look at us. We're not doing nothing. I don't know if they get spooked or not. Let's see, can I, oh, oh look at that. It went up like 10% with one flower. That's amazing, this isn't gonna take long at all. No, don't look me in the face. Apparently they don't get Oh, we got him! We got Alistrosisum, Alistrosaurus. Uh, what does it say about this guy? Despite being among the island's tinier rubies, incredibly resilient. It recovers its torpor and health much faster than most creatures. Uh, okay, you can't knock it unconscious. Domesticated. Extremely loyal pet. It's like a little dog with little fangs. We'll name him up later. Hey, what's going on? You're my little buddy. Can I see you? Oh, look. He looks like an alien, kind of. Well, his eyes look alien-ish, like. You look kind of mean. You might be like... You look like something that would be in Doom. Like, one of the demons. <sighs> You're a demon. We might have to name you after some sort of demon. Let's take this guy back to base, and then... I'm thinking we'll tame up at least, like, three of these guys. Because... I don't know what their radius is like, and then we want to have extras in case they... I don't know if they lay eggs or not. Probably not, but... I don't know if they're considered, like, uh, mammals or not. You look like a mammal, sorta. But, I don't know. We'll just drop them. Bruno, what are you doing? Bruno, are you for serious? Is this real life right now, Bruno? How did you get out? Bruno, you're a bad monkey. Get back in your cage with the other monkeys. I don't know, who let you out? Where'd the other monkeys go? How do you guys keep getting out of here? Oh wait, there's a monkey over there. Where's the other monkey? Is he underneath of us? No, you guys stay in there. Is the other monkey down here? He sounds like he's down here. Hmm. How do you guys keep sneaking out? I'm gonna find out one of these days, and then I'm gonna plug up a hole, wherever you guys are. Okay, we got Snow Pro. He's like sticking out of the... Are you glitching through the wall? Is that what you guys are doing? Hmm. Okay, we'll stick. We'll like... Oh, there he is! Jimbo, what the heck? How do you get out of here? Get back in there, Jimbo. Oh, wait, what? Get in there. I'm closing the door. Hmm. I got my eye on you, Snowpro Jr. If you glitch through the wall, I'll know. Because I'll be back with another Listro. Keep my eye on you. But I'm going to pile all the Listros here. And then we'll name them all when we get back. Let's see. Let's look what happens when I pet it. Oh, he's jumping! for joy but look he's like leveling up this guy see he's got a little extra experience bar over his head i don't know what the range is on this guy though hmm let's see okay enable wandering hmm. he's not like leveling up this guy or anything interesting it's not very far range if it is hmm. let's find out let's go get another guy we'll bring him back see what's what we're doing some double taming here, guys. I found two of them next to each other. We got a male and a female. They're mate boosted. But this guy, a level 26 male. That's like, up. Oh, I pooped. So exciting that I pooped. And he pooped twice. Double poops. Let's see. He's going. This one's taming up as fast as the level one is. That's amazing. These guys are super easy to tame. And this guy, this gal is a level five female. So we're going to have two males, one female. And then maybe we'll get more than three. Now that I know that they take very little time to tame, we'll grab some more females after this. But uh, I'll bring you guys back when these two are tamed up and we got them at base. And we're back, under cover of darkness, taming up. What is making that noise? Oh, I think it's me, because I'm freezing. I'm, how am I freezing in the southern, earth's most warmest place? We found this level 27 female to go with our level 27 male. Or 26 male, did we find? Something, something like that. But then we'll have two females and two males. And then these guys only take, like, seven rare flowers to tame up. Look at that, level 27 is going to get 13 levels. And I'm just like, I'm almost already 25% done since I've just been talking to you guys. So we're going to tame this gal up, get her back to base, and then I'll figure out if I want to go get a 5th or 6th or 7th, 8th, ninth, 10th one of these guys. And then we'll figure out if they, like, do more effectiveness if they're in groups or whatnot. And then I'll be back. Peace. We got her! Level. We'll 
level are you? Level 40, Tim Bat, level 40. I gotta say, these are one of like, these are the most uh, satisfying tames because they don't take very long and they can't get spooked or anything, but then they tame out at like an extremely high level and it just makes you so satisfied, like, yes, I accomplished something. And then you can tame up like a mazillion of them and you just feel like you got a little family going on, you know? Like our little family of Lister is has been born in less than, I don't even know how long we've been doing this. Not that long, but we already got four of them. We got, yep, they're mate boosted now. We'll drop in this one. Bloop. Have fun, guys. We'll out, go out and look for some more females. Cause that, we got a level 40, a level 38, level one, and a level seven. I think we'll get maybe one more female and see how that works out. And then I'll be back. And we're pulling back into base right as it becomes morning on Ark with our sixth Lystrosaurus. Lystras medoodlers. We got six of these bad boys and gals. We got three males and three females. While we were taming up our last female, there was also a male in the area, and I was like, eh, why not? I'm already gonna be here for a little while anyway, so I tamed them both up at the same time. So now we got three and three. Let's see what happens if we pet one. <gasps> Wait, is that an egg? They do give eggs! Oh my gosh. What are these eggs gonna be used for? Can I get one? Pick up. <gasps> one Lystro egg. <gasps> Does anyone else have eggs for me? Bell's fast. We're gonna have to put you gals. Where are the gals? Actually, everyone, just follow me. We gotta take you to your new homes. Well, hold on. We only need one. We'll get the females in their spots. Female, female, male. And one male in their spot. And then we need our last female. Can I whistle? Or no? I think I'm lagging. Am I lagging? Okay, there we go. Follow me. We're getting to you guys, to so your new spots. Where should we put these guys? Uh... Over here? Maybe we should put it like... Will you watch our new friends? Uh, Tailspin, will you watch our new brothers and sisters? <gasps> here we go, we got four of them. Okay, we need to put them somewhere where they're gonna get eggs, but still give good experience. So that's probably right here, because they'll give experience to this whole building. Let's just see if we can get them a little ways in. And then, keep coming, keep coming, stop. Right there. <gasps> You're a little far behind. Let's get you a little further up. This way. Come on, you can do it. Stop. Are you the male? No, I don't think so. Where's the male? We need to pull the male out. So it's easier to grab the eggs. Turn around. Stop. Okay, now they got their little egg boost from Classy Girl over here. And they're mate boosted. And if we pet them. <gasps> oh look, they're jumping for joy. Can we pet all of them? We're gonna pet everybody. Look at that. Uh, oh, look at their experience boosting this whole thing. That's amazing. I wonder if they get better range if they're in groups or what? They're not reaching the Stegos. But why are they reaching this building? Hmm. If we pet you, how far do you guys reach? Okay. Only Soul Gobbler. Why aren't you guys experience boosted? That's kind of weird. And not all the tracks are experience boosted. My tribe mate Brandon was killed. That's not good. What was he killed by? Hmm. Maybe we should go check that out. I'll have to go check that out. But for now, that's gonna be it for this episode. I'm gonna go ahead and name these guys between now and the next episode, and then when we come back for the next episode, I will tell you what we named them, because I am terrible with names, and it's probably gonna take me all week in order to come up with names, to be honest with you. And then we'll put these guys in a place where they give better experience to what's around them. I might put one up on the hill over there, but for now, I wanna thank you all very much for joining me, and we'll probably try for a Quetzal again next weekend, and hopefully, we can start carrying some bigger dinos around. Um, maybe get a taming pin going, drop some bears in there, something, something. Lots of stuff for the future, you guys. And yeah, that's it. Thanks again, and please be sure to do what the next screen tells you to. Peace out, guys.